Hello everyone, it's a simple tutorial. I'm trying to give you a very short lecture about the voice change. So, from active to passive, I'm trying to teach you active to passive. You need not go for many rules. Don't you ever try. It depends on a single rule. Just remember one very very deep kind of thing what is it this is here you see this is a structure of an active sentence here you see principal verb you see object you see auxiliary verb you see subject right so all you need to do if you want to change an active sentence into a passive one all you need to do is replace this principal verb by another principal verb b B means M is there, was where B being been, you know it. And this particular principal verb must be turned into past participle, that means adjective. This is all. And object will come here, subject will go there. And auxiliary verb remains unchanged. See, I play cricket. You see, principal verb is play here, and it is going to be replaced by M is R, that means principal verb B. And this principal verb, particular principal verb is turned into past participle, that means adjective. So, here play is present form. So, M is R should come here. But which one? It is determined by the object when it comes here as a subject. You see, cricket is here. This is present form. So, M is R. So, with cricket, it is appropriate, right? Cricket is and this particular principal verb is turned into an adjective and that means past participle cricket is played by me it is nominative subject here turned into objective subject here that means objective pronoun this is subjective pronoun that means nominative objective so remember one very thing that means this particular principal verb should be replaced by the principal verb be that means m is r for the present indefinite present form this is present form so m is r is present form so which one will come with the cricket it is determined by the subject here cricket is right cricket is played by me okay for another uh, continuous tense you see they are playing the piano so this is playing right according to this particular principal verb it must be replaced by be so it is ing it is ing being and this one is turned into past participle that means adjective so being played an auxiliary verb is here because the piano is here and the piano is is the main verb here and being and played by them so the piano is here by them is there and auxiliary verb is never changed and the piano is and the principal verb is replaced by another principal verb b that means it, this is ing it should be ing and it must go as first participle this is what the princ principal verb is changed in the passive sentences so you need not go for many rules this is a single solo rule that the principal verb must be replaced by another principal verb B and this particular principal verb must be turned into past participle that means adjective and object will come here, subject will go there, auxiliary verb is never changed. Okay? It is just a, it is just a simple and sample of changes of the sentences from active to passive. Keep waiting, I will give you in detail and uh, please subscribe my channel press the bell icon just close to it and share my videos to your friends and families this is it thank you so very much